hello 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 and welcome back to my channel so today i'm going to be talking about something really really powerful you know you are really going to enjoy it so and i'm working with a coach i'm presently working with a really good action coach you know and he taught me a concept that i want to share with all of us today you guys you know i don't really love to learn alone i love to share knowledge which is really really very powerful so so let me start by asking a question right have you ever been in a situation when things didn't go as planned right you have all your activities well planned out or you have your active you know things that you want to do well planned out and something happens and just scattered all your plans and just destructed all your plans or have you ever encountered a problem you're working on a project you're working as a team you have a personal project and you just encountered problem so what we're going to be talking today is going to tackle that and tell you what is the way to go so we're going to be looking at a concept called the point of power the point of power this is this. so this is the point of power right here right so the point of power you can either go up which is positive or you can either go down which is negative so this is the point where you are in charge you have that problem you encounter that problem you encounter that that difficulty and you need to take a decision or a circumstances has happened and a circumstance has happened sorry pardon me then you need to take a decision so at this point you have the power so that's the point of power so let us go further so the point of power has two arrows one going down and one going up so the arrow going down basically means this <laughs> you're either going to bed so the acronym is bed which is blame excuse and denial at that point of power you can either decide to go down go below the point of power and once you go below the point of power you're going to bed <laughs> you're sleeping you know you're feeling all cozy up you know and nothing happens when you're in bed you know you're not moving when you're in bed you're sleeping right so at that point of power when you decide to go down you are, you are blaming someone for the situation that either you are blaming something you are blaming someone you are blaming the circumstances right you are giving excuses oh it's not my fault this was this happened that happened you are giving excuses or you are living in denial you know living in denial basically means that oh you you, you, are, you don't even accept that there's a problem so when you when you don't accept that there's a circumstance or there's an issue you're not even working towards solving that problem you're not working towards improving yourself so you can live above that problem or live above that circumstance so at all the time when you blame and you give excuses you're not in control you know you're, you're giving the external circumstances power over that situation right you're not in control you're powerless you're saying oh I'm not in charge i'm not responsible and the standard factor has power over that situation or have power over that circumstance so let me tell you guys where you need to be and also living in denial is also really very terrible because you are not making efforts to surpass that problem you are, you are telling yourself oh there's no challenge actually but there is a huge problem there's a huge challenge but this is where we need to be we need to be here we need to all all you, you remember you, you know or is that, a, is that a paddle we used to, you know, paddle the boat? Let's go. You're all in. You know, you're going. So, for all, we need to take ownership. Ownership, we need to be accountable and we need to be responsible. So, at the point of power, what we need to do, what we need to come to our mind is how can we take ownership of this situation? How may we be accountable and how may we take responsibility? this framework is really really very powerful so we are always around situations you know problem come circumstances hit us things don't go as planned but when anything don't go as planned let's remember oh how can i take ownership of this situation how can i be accountable you know taking myself as being responsible i'm a responsible person and i'm taking ownership of this issue i'm accountable and i'm being responsible so this is what we should always think about we should always be on top we should be above the 
point of power when we are above the point of power you know this is a positive area area where we are positive area where we are powerful not powerless when we are here we are powerful when we are here we are also the victor we are heading towards victory right but when we are here we are telling ourselves oh we are the victim oh this has happened to me oh, i need to go to bed i need to close up i need to feel safe i need to blame somebody i need to uh, uh, you know remove myself from that situation and look for someone to blame or look for an excuse to be so we should always own our ship get our all and always all ourselves to victory so don't go to bed don't go to bed always or you are at the point of power whenever you are at the point of power think about this uh, concept think about taking ownership being accountable and being responsible and always be the victor not the victim always be at a point where you have control where you have power not at a point where you are powerless not at a point when you give the power to the external circumstances next time i'm so glad i love this framework if you've not subscribed to my channel come on now come on come on come on. subscribe to next time bye for now